like father, like son. Eight-year-old Robert Irwin fed his first saltwater crocodile at the family zoo in Australia. Armed with just a bucket of garfish, he didn't show any fear as he stepped into the pen. When they're walking right at you, you it's kind of it's kind of funny watching that how they're striking up, but not not too nervous. It was, but it was pretty fun. Robert's relationship with the reptiles began when he was just a baby, when his father Steve controversially held him, aged just a month old, whilst feeding a giant crocodile. A well-known conservationist and wildlife expert, Steve Irwin, died in 2006 after being struck in the chest by a stingray's barb. He owned and built the zoo in Biwa, in which his family lives, which has made his son pretty fearless when it comes to wildlife. Living in a zoo, it's... No, I'm not really scared of anything, but it's pretty fun. Every, every day I get to wake up to the tigers and elephants and crocs and everything. Robert's mother, Terry, said the family hoped to continue Steve's legacy of wildlife conservation. Rupa Suchak, BBC News.